Now let's say for our sake, I wanted to come in and I wanted to insert a, an element. I wanted to come in and let's, just because I arbitrarily made some space here, I wanted to insert 35. So how would I go about doing this? The first thing I need to do is find where, uh, where in my skip list to insert it. We know, yes, it magically is here, uh, but we still have to kind of treat this as if we were uh, a machine, a robot, uh, so we do have to go through that same process of doing our lookup. No. Yep. We come through. We skip over. No. Yep. We skip over. No. You can jump ahead really quickly if you need to. I'm almost done. Yep. Nope. Yep. Nope. Or yep. And no. So I know I can't go any further uh, than 35, 39. This finally tells me where to put my 35. So da 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 da, I come in and I have my 35. Huzzah. Now the big important question is if we notice if I just did that all the time, that was it, that, then what would happen if I, in, I do like 800 more inserts? They're all just going here at the bottom. So one of the things we also have to do is we have to determine how much it goes up. How many uh, levels does 35 go up? Now this is going to actually surprise you, uh, but in the just truly generic sense of a uh, linked, a, a skip list, I just go up some random number. I know, some go up some random number. For our sake, I do kind of have a capping point. I don't want to input here if I don't have to. Um, I, you know, so maybe five plus one. Uh, I can go up to six levels um, in our sense. And for my sake, I will actually uh, play the role of random. Oh. You can already see I've been practicing. Uh, so uh, flip a coin. I flipped a coin. Tails. All right, well, that means I'm done. Goodbye. Uh, no, let's go ahead and argue. Say I flipped and I got a heads in this case. Well, that means that I would come up here and I would add 35 again. So let's flip it again. Heads. Heads means that, guess what, I come up and I add it to the next level. This is sort of my way of implementing it. I'll flip it one more time, quote, end quote, one more time. Nope, i got to flip it again. Welcome to sort of, this is apparently a very important element inside here. So cross your fingers. Tails. Oh, man, love the random. So I stop here. Now, that's not the best implementation. Someone out there on the Internet is going to be like, that's a terrible, you know, why random? It's always, you know, it can return no all the time. Yes, that's actually a great area of research, of determining how levels, how high levels up in a skip list go. So, if you're actually curious, that's one of the things you can do. So, since I'm already here, what happens if I then, in turn, came down? And I wanted to do a remove, and for our sake, I'm going to say remove 17. So let me clear off my board for just a second. So like I just said, I want to come in and do a remove 17. Well, just like we did with my insert of 35. It doesn't matter that we're not, it's not here. It won't actually affect us too terribly much. But... I start once again, and I have to find the location of 17, assuming 17 all exists in here. For our sake, it doesn't, or it does, so I get it. Now, this is the easy part. Uh, as you can imagine, I simply delete this. I remove it out of the skip list if we're uh, thinking about this in an implementation sense. This is a node, right, that has infinity in it. Uh, that's a little too small. Let me make it a little bigger. 
that had negative infinity in it and it was pointing to 17, we now just point it to our positive infinity. That same thing is going to happen because I have to go down. I have to go down every level, remove it. Again, this tail is going to go here. I go down a level. Not tail, sorry, next. I remove it. Next is going to change to the next element. Come through here. That, ah, look, it's not just there. It's 12 now has that. Finally, on this last element, it gets removed. The reason why I'm kind of explicitly doing all this stuff out is because one of the things I want to think about, and I'm going to uh, kind of get rid of it, let's say I came in and 17 no longer exists. Well, you might notice I happen to have two levels uh, that are both just positive and negative infinity, and that's it. So one of the other things I do, since I've stripped out my... That's a terrible... That's not the color I want. I think this is a little darker. It'll work. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and there. Since I have these two levels, and I don't... You know, it's that's a little bit of a redundant issue... I start basically getting rid of top levels until I only have one of these left. So in essence, that S5 also gets removed in as many uh, levels as possible. If there were you know, two levels of 17 that were by themselves and I deleted 17, I would do the same thing. But in this sense, I do have to get it until I only have one level, the top level, and in this our world, of positive and of negative and positive infinity.